guys, it's Ashley. I just wanted to share a collective haul um, from some items I ordered online and then a couple things I found this weekend. So there is a scrapbook store by me. It's called Violet, um, but they tend to carry a lot of stamps and things. So I don't go there too often because they really don't carry a lot of uh, paper lines. But there's a couple sheets I found. I want to use these for making shakers. And um, so there's some Easter theme. This is Spring Wishes um, by Photo Play. I just thought it was really cute. I um, just got it for the cutter parts. And then there's also Hello Easter by Echo Park. And again, I got this for the cutter parts. I got this Echo Park Perfect Princess for the same thing. I'm going to be doing a whimsical swap um, in a few months. And then I never saw this collection, but um, I saw this paper. And it's Magical by Photoplay as well. It has all these cute... Um, I love this plaid. It's like a rainbow plaid, but I got it for the unicorns. And then I also got this set of cut aparts from Fairy Tale. This is the Fairy Tale collection by Doodlebug. And I want to try making some shakers. I hate my fuse tool. I know well, I'm not alone in that. A lot of people have problems with it. So I got some adhesive um, sleeves to test out. So let me share what I got in from Joanne. They had a sale. I haven't shopped at Joanne in a long time. But they had a sale. And um, I picked up some things from there. And... I got these sprinkles from, this is Sweet Treats. I got this little unicorn from the Fairy Tales collection. I got these from the Pebbles collection. I um, can't remember the name of it. I think it was called like Girl Power or something like that. I got these stickers that have all these different phrases on them. Girl Squad, I think, is the name of it, actually. <clears throat> and then I got these from Pink Paisley. Really cute. Oh, my heart. I got these Girl Squad stickers as well. I just thought they were really cute. I love this one, Freye. Got some coffee and treats. Some cute little. I got these sprinkles as well that go with the fairy tales collection. And then these are the adhesive bags that I want to try making some shakers with. Um, these are three, three point one two by four point one two. And then there's 2.12 by 3.12. And then these are 4 and 3 quarters by 5 and 3 quarters. So I got these self sealing bags to try making some shakers with. Let's see how that works out. And then I got the odds and ends from the Fairy Tales collection. And I also got the paper pad, the 6x6, as well as the mini icons. Cute. And then I got the regular full size icons as well. And that's what I picked up from Julian. And then I also hit Hobby Lobby and Target and Tuesday morning. I missed out on the coupon the other day at Michael's. So I'm kind of mad at myself for not going. Um, at Hobby Lobby. I only got one thing that's not that exciting. I got these refills. The other day I showed up bought a four pack of the dispensers from um, Tuesday morning for $5.99. And these refills are an eight pack for $8.99. And with a 40% off coupon, they're only $5.39. So if you keep the um, little outside adhesive case, this is it right here, you can get the refills for half the price so I just got a set of the refills for that because I 
I do have an ATG gun, but I don't like to use it on small items. So, um, from Target, I just got a, one of these sets of stickers. And I got some of these little pencils. I don't even use pencils that often, but they're so cute. Um, and then I found these little confetti tubes that were on clearance. $2.48 for six, and they have pretty spring colors. So I'm going to try to use those in my shakers. And then the last thing I got, which I am curious to see um, and open up because these are from Target. These are from the Spritz collection, and they are Easter shapes, 151 count. They were $2.99, which I thought was a good price. And um, they had some cute, like, look at this holographic... Um, Easter egg, and then they had little Easter baskets, they had lots of bunny cutouts, um, they have birds in here, and they're textured, so I thought these were a good deal to use on some Easter projects, look how cute, decorate them up as embellishments maybe, send some in swaps, but they're actually really cute, I'm impressed for $2.99, I think that's a really good deal. I know a lot of people die cut, but I mean, if you think about how many are in here and all the different shapes and all the different textures and um, all that stuff, I thought it was a good deal. I've also seen the chipboard stickers, but I passed on those because I wasn't really impressed with, there's only a couple that I liked. Um, I wish I could have gotten a hold of the Easter ones. If anybody has extra of the Easter chipboard shapes, I mean, uh, the Valentine shapes from Spritz. I would love to buy them from you because I never saw them in my store and by the time I saw them they were already on clearance and gone so I would love to trade or swap or buy a set but um I found this simple story set at Tuesday morning for $5.99 and I debated on this because I bought some of the stickers that go with this but it's just so cute the cut aparts are really cute and I just love the colors, so I did end up getting it. I really don't need any more paper. I don't think any of us do, to be honest. But And then I also got this Pebbles collection, um, which I debated on getting, but I just thought it was cute for spring. I don't usually do Easter projects, but since I decided to do some Easter swaps, um, I love the swan paper, though, and the teacups. I thought that this would be a cute collection. It does have some cut-aparts as well. So I did pick up that. So, as for 